Greetings, your breakfast cereal or your favorite candy might just come from a muddy field in the Mondak region. The Yellowstone River Valley is home to about 110 growers who are part of Sydney Sugars. Jim Olson takes us on a tour to see how the company turns 32,000 acres of beets into a million tons of sugar. They call this Sugar Valley. I am the agriculturalist for the Sugar Valley Growing District um, for Sydney Sugars in Sydney, Montana. And Catherine Psycho considers the sugar beet farmers who work here her family. All the growers are really special to me. We try and work together all year, especially during harvest. Um, it can get a little tough. The harvest has been a bit messy this year because of rain and snow. It means farmers have to employ an extra tractor sometimes to pull the semi through the field as it's filled up with muddy sugar beets. Yeah, kind of normal, it seems like. It never fails during beet season. But Tim Karst isn't complaining. He's in the middle of lifting a great crop. Yeah, the yield's really been good so far. We're real happy with it, yep. After the beets are plucked from the turf, they come here to the Sugar Valley Dumping Station, a stopping off point on their way here, the Sydney Sugars plant in Sydney, Montana. This is where the trucks dump the beets. Trucks have been arriving for weeks now, dumping their loads of beets into the mini river that washes them into the processing plant, where their journey from field to table takes a big step forward, starting with getting sliced into thin pieces. Now they're ready to take the sugar out. We use hot water at this point to diffuse the sugar out. The process continues to extract the sugar from the plants and to crystallize it until it ends up here where it's loaded, sometimes into 50 or 100 pound bags, but more frequently into these one ton bags, what they call super sacks. It's a lot easier to handle a 2,000 pound bag than it is with a bunch of 50s. These super sacks are always by forklift, so it makes moving it easier, it's cleaner. Um, Easier to load the truck, easier to get out. These sacks are headed for Compact Industry, a craft company. Here are some bags for a company that makes pancake mix and other products. Safe to say the sugar produced here goes a long distance. Our market's mainly Chicago to the west. Now this year we're expecting uh, to harvest over a million ton. In the corporate offices, the general manager and ag manager are excited about a very good year that's shaping up. We're looking, forecasting a 32.5 ton to the acres. That's slightly above average. We're very happy with that number. And they're happy to have another sugar beet harvest well underway. Jim Olson, KX News. The Sydney Sugars Harvest is about 70% complete and should wrap up in about 10 days. Still to come on KX News at 5.